All right, this is Model 2 Sega CD with Model 1 Genesis. Sega CD is not working properly after capacitor replacement. Let's give it some power. Right. Let's close the disk thing. Now the screen says it's checking disk and then press start button. Obviously it hasn't spun the disk so it hasn't actually checked it. We hear the laser click when the lid closes however no activity. You can barely see that with this lighting that the laser is coming on when the lid closes and trying to detect a disc. However, the motor does not spin. This was noticed after replacing especially this capacitor here, which has been set back to the original stock one after a replacement didn't do any better. Before changing the capacitors on this Sega CD, it was working normally. The capacitors were changed because of some heavy interference and a lot of electrolytic fluid that was inside all over the board. Changed them as a precautionary method since we don't want the PCB to erode. If anyone can help me figure out why the CD mechanism is not spinning anymore, I would appreciate it. It should not be the potentimeters because it was suddenly after a capacitor replacement.